North America's Most Dangerous Roads North America is a continent of roads and most known for its well-maintained highways. Of course, there is always an exception. The continent also has a fair share of dangerous roads. Here's a look at the deadliest roads in North America. Welcome to the Dangerous Road series. This is Lifehack Lion, the channel that gives you amazing life hacks and interesting facts. Make sure to watch this video till the end because you don't want to miss North America's deadliest road. Number 10. Waipio Valley Road in Hawaii It is the steepest road of its length in the United States. With some 45% grade sections, the steepness is enough to stall engines on the way up and damage brakes on the way down. Although it is only around 1.2 kilometers long, it is a 900-foot descent and a paved, one-lane road that is only open to four-wheel drive vehicles. With innumerable twists and turns, the road is extremely difficult and a nightmare in the wet or dark or both. The zone is prone to heavy mist causing low visibility and avalanches, heavy snowfalls and landslides that can occur anytime. This road has a well-deserved reputation for being dangerous and an extremely challenging drive. It should not be attempted by anyone who is not familiar with the road or doesn't have an appropriate vehicle. Number 9. Bella Coola Road in Canada It is a 451 kilometers long road located in British Columbia, Canada, and it is one of the most treacherous roads in the country. Only the first 319 kilometers are paved and the rest is an all-season gravel road. The road descends 43 kilometers of steep, narrow road with sharp hairpin turns and two major switchbacks to the Bella Coola Valley. The descent includes a 9-kilometer section with grades up to 18%. Unpredictable snowstorms and blizzards made driving extremely challenging. The drive can be a nerve-wracking experience that tourists who have driven to Bella Coola from Williams Lake have been known to refuse to drive back and have had to be taken out by boat or float plane. Number 8. Engineer Pass in Colorado It is a high mountain pass at an elevation of 12,800 feet above sea level. This trail, combined with Cinnamon Pass, constitutes the famous Alpine Loop. Engineer Pass remains an adrenaline-pumping journey and should not be treated lightly. The first two miles are the most rugged and difficult, with rocks protruding from the road. This track can be very muddy and slippery after rain, making it challenging to get through. During and after a storm, the road is impassable even with a four-wheel drive vehicle. Taking extreme precautions can make the drive definitely worth it. On the summit, there are 360-degree panoramic views of 14,000 peaks. You will see the Mount Snuffles, Uncompagor Peak, Lake City Volcanic Caldera, Old Mines, Ghost Towns, Wildflowers, and a scenic beauty that is truly epic. Number 7. Schaefer Canyon Road in Utah it is an 18-mile dangerous dirt track that requires extreme caution for vehicles and mountain bikes, especially in inclement weather and at night. If you are someone who is looking for an off-road experience but doesn't have access to a highly modified rock crawler, you might want to give this road a try. Although the road has been improved by the National Park Service, the Schaefer Trail is extremely steep and travels along the tops of the sheer cliffs. There are some narrow sections that are scarcely wide enough for two cars. Also, the track can get very muddy and slippery after rain and can be impassable when icy. Some sections have large, sharp rocks that require tight maneuvering and increase the likelihood of tire damage. The road is bordered by a drop of hundreds of feet with no guardrails. At the top, you will see a breathtaking panorama of canyon lances, sculpted pinnacles, and buttes. Definitely, the drive is worth it. Number 6. Route 550 in Colorado Also known as the Million Dollar Highway, this route is one of the country's most spectacular drives. 
It stretches for about 40 kilometers and climbs up to three very high mountain passes. This highway delivers jaw-dropping vista after vista. So what makes this road extremely dangerous? The weather in this zone is harsh and highly unpredictable, and it does not take much for the bright sunshine to change over to moderate to heavy snowfall. The stretch through the gorge is characterized by steep cliffs, narrow lanes, and a lack of guardrails. This mountain road has numerous hairpin curves and dangerous drop-offs that will give consequences you can imagine. If you want to enjoy the magnificent scenery, better drive with care and give it your 100% concentration. Number 5. Kahikili Highway in Hawaii It is a strip of one-lane paved road framed by rocks on one side and sheer cliff drops on the other. With a length of 32 kilometers, this is a legendary road known for its snaking turns, narrow passages, and dangerous road conditions. Located in Maui County, this road is named after the great chief Kahikili who built houses from the skulls of his enemies. There is a little room for error in this road because even with one lane, it has two-way traffic. Driving at night or in poor visibility is not recommended as the road only has minimal reflectors and guardrails. If it is raining or has been raining, you better skip this route because mud and rock slides can occur anytime. Kahikili Highway is mostly traveled not for the thrill of driving on the edge of a cliff, but for the beauty of the West Maui Natural Reserve to the west and the Pacific Ocean to the east. Number 4. Moki Dugway in Utah It is a staggering, graded dirt switchback road carved into the face of the cliff edge of Cedar Mesa. The road consists of 5 kilometers of steep, unpaved, and 11% grade switchbacks that will take you up to 1,200 feet from the valley floor. Given the road's condition, it is important for drivers to pay close attention to navigating their way through it. The surface of the road is gravel and sand and can easily get muddy after rain. Although this route is open all year, it can be closed when it is not cleared of snow. While this route can give you a thrilling and dangerous ride, it will provide you breathtaking views of some of Utah's most beautiful sights, including the Valley of the Gods and the Monument Valley. Number 3. Oh My God Road in Colorado it is a very scenic trail at an elevation of about 7,500 to 9,400 feet. The road gets its name from being a two-way road that is only about a car and three-quarters wide, graveled with no guardrails and washed-out shoulders. And if you dare to glance down, it will reveal incredibly steep cliffs. The road offers lots of hairpin turns as it ascended, Hugging the side of the mountain. Like many mountain passes, you should beware of landslides, avalanches, and mudslides when taking this route. With all the switchbacks and steep drop off, the road is a real challenge and a true test of your vehicle and your stamina. Number 2 Espinazo del Diablo in Mexico. The Devil's Backbone is a famous treacherous mountain road in Mexico. The road lies almost entirely over 6,600 feet above sea level and covers a stretch of about 10 kilometers. The road is so curvy and twisted, it will take you 7 to 8 hours to cross. The route runs across dozens of ravines, bends with bumpy asphalt, and suffers from recurrent fogs and roaming wild animals. According to a local legend, the road got its name when the Archangel Michael threw the devil from heaven and he landed on Earth. His backbone formed the rugged ridgeline of the Sierra Madras. The route has a bad reputation for being accident-prone and having a high death toll. Also, the area is so remote and inaccessible enough that drug-related crimes are said to be rampant. And of course, number one. North America's Most Dangerous Road Dalton Highway in Alaska Dubbed as the loneliest road on the planet, this highway is one of the most isolated roads in the world. 
Drivers on the Dalton Highway are advised to bring their safety gear as there are no medical facilities along the 414-mile road and no gas stations, restaurants, or hotels for a 240-mile stretch. Much of the road is unpaved and made of gravel, making it difficult for drivers even in good weather conditions. In the winter, the surrounding tundra is prone to avalanches and the road becomes so slippery and icy that even road truckers refuse to cross it. If you're giving this road a try, make sure to take extreme precautions. Do you know some other dangerous roads in North America or do you have any other requests for our next video? Let us know in the comment section below. If you find this video interesting, we'd love you to support us for more life hacks and interesting facts.